Kelsey here with Anna. Let's go ahead and get started. All you need is your mat. So we're starting off with the dancer sweep. One leg over, arms out to the side. Now I want you to think like a dancer. Really graceful, shoulders down away from the ears, chest open, belly in. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna sweep that leg out, straighten it, straighten it, straighten it. Bring it all the way to the back, keep that chest lifted, and then come back to starting. Yes, let's go. Whoa. Boom, here, front. And tap. Do you feel it, Anna? Oh my goodness. Yes. Trying to keep the chest up is really hard. Yeah, and then Sweet. when you do that, it looks a lot more graceful, too. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Ooh. And really lengthen that leg behind you. You really want to feel like you're performing, you're on stage. And uh, where, where are you performing right now, Anna? <laughs> Who are you performing for? Oh man, I am not a ballerina. <laughs> I am not graceful. <laughs> Well, you look really good. Ooh. I can see from right here, you look really good. Oh, I really feel that in my obliques. I love it. Yes, this is like a double, triple wing. Eyes too, and such a great way to get ready for that bikini booty. Oh yeah. Right? <laughs> Beautiful. Exhale as you push back and front. Love it. And give me one more right here. Ooh. Hold it long, really bow, bring the chest open, and bring your friend. Okay, switch over. Let's do wow. it. Wow, this is a double whammy. I feel like <laughs> it is a double whammy. the booty and the obliques. You are doing fantastic. Let's do this. Push it back. And front. Tab. Now, if you want to make it harder, you can actually keep your foot elevated right here so you really get those, um, those quads. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Push back. Good. Now, really push with the leg. Yes, and I oh, love it. That was a big difference. Uh-huh. And really imagine there's a string pulling from your heart center all the way to the ceiling. That's how you want to bow, okay? With grace, proudness, <laughs> love it. You pointing the toes. How are you guys doing at home? Ooh. Ooh, I think they look good. I like this. Yeah. I am feeling it everywhere in my booty. That's good. <laughs> okay, come on, a little bit more. Push it back. Nice. Few more. Press. Love it. Two more. All the way long. Can you make this one the best one? Come oh. on. Push it back. Bow. Oh. Front. And give your leg a nice wow. little hug. I like Fantastic. that. Fantastic. Okay. Oh We're gosh. moving on. We're moving on. To the cross butt lift. Okay. So on all fours, hands right underneath the shoulders. I want you to go ahead and take your knee, place it right behind your other knee. Now guys at home, please do not lean over just so you can touch the other side of your mat. You want to try to keep mm. that thigh nice and straight. Okay. And Go as far as you can. Now you're gonna tap and you're gonna lift up. Now at this point, I want you to squeeze your butt, okay? So, boom, and lift. Yes, boom, and lift, perfect. And you, want, you do not wanna lock out your elbows. Your eyes staying on the edge of your mat. Inhale, down, exhale, lift, and boom, and lift. Ooh, that little lift, squeeze down. at the top is yeah, everything, that's right. right? Down, and lift, good. And up, love, oh. down. And live. How you feeling? I love how this just really isolates the outer booty. Yes, that is right. Ah, uh, boom. And up. Inhale down. Exhale lift. Now I want you to lift a little higher, Anna. Up. Uh, and you two at home, guys. Come on, don't, don't, don't give me any like weenie stuff. <laughs> I want the real thing. Up. <laughs> I think I was taking it easy, huh? Yes, no. Hey, this is the first time we've met after years of watching each other, and you will not. You will not do this half. <laughs> That's <laughs> right, all out. She's laughing nervously. Okay, two more. <laughs> and up, uh, one more. Boom, hold it high, hold it. Okay, repeat on the side, let's go. Tap, and lift, good. Straighten that leg, all the way up. Straighten, boom, and up. Nice work. Yeah, As breathing is important. Uh-huh, very important. And with my workouts, don't make it breathing too complicated. You can inhale when it's easy, exhale when it's hard. So here, obviously, when the leg comes up, it's hard. So just like that. Lift. Now keep those elbows soft. Don't lock them. Up and down. Belly into the spine. Nice and tight. You're already feeling that other butt cheek. Yep, because it was working already. And we give it another round of work. Up and down. Lift. Very nice. Beautiful work. Even on this stabilizing leg, uh -huh. I really feel it. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Look at that form. She looks good. Getting better as I practice. Uh, you know she's a professional. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. Give me four. Mm -hmm. Three. Ooh. Good. Two. One more. Hold it up. Hold it. Up, hold it. Ah! 
and down. Oh. Okay, yeah, booty nice little pack, little pack. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go into the clamshells. Okay. So I want you down on your side, supporting the head, supporting the chest, knees in fetal position, okay? As if you're laying at the beach, but not really, because we're getting ready for the beach. Yeah. All I want you to do for the clamshell, open up, squeeze your butt here, okay? Now there's a difference between opening and closing, and opening and holding and closing. Ready? In three, two, one, let's go. Up and down, so squeeze and lower. Now Anna, you're gonna love this, I have a tip. Oh boy. Okay. If you want this to be a crazy move, all you do is grab a dumbbell, place it right here, lightly hold fingers, and that burn is going to be like 800 times. Great extra challenge. But yes. I'm feeling this with nothing. That's right. Especially when I'm doing it right. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Take out the floor. Yes. Look at Take the floor. Out the floor. Her chest is open, her hips are square. She's not leaning back. Don't lean back, guys. You want to get what you need to get out of this workout, you do it right. Do it with good form. And down. Again, we exhale up. Inhale down, lift and open. So good, very nice. Up and down. Woo. Perfect. Five. I like to put my hand right on the glute so I can just yes, feel it. Yeah, feel it working. Yep. That's right. And one more. Hold it. Hold it. Uh. And down. Okay. Now lift both of those heels up. Okay. Huh? Now lift up that top leg. Now all I want you to do. Draw a little circle on top, just like this. Okay, make sure that bottom, uh, like ankle, half bottom part of your foot is lifted up. Oh boy. Yes, and you want to keep this leg straight. You want to keep it nice and tight. You're drawing tiny little pink circles in in the sky, and I'm saying pink because I'm here at the Pop Sugar Studios. Everything is pink <laughs> and white, and I love it. <laughs> Who doesn't love pink? I love pink. You can see it as mad as pink. It's awesome. Uh. Okay, keep going. Love it, love it, love it. Reverse, back, back. Nice. And for me, honestly, I feel like going backwards, I'm really pushing and it's a little yeah. bit harder too. That It's hard for me to remember to keep my bottom leg up. Oh, it yeah. It keeps How, dropping towards the floor. Yeah, no, keep it up, keep it up. You know, it's hard for me to turn backwards. You're lucky, Anna. <laughs> keep going. A little bit more. And you're pointing your toes. You're lengthening your leg, drawing those little circles in the sky. Give me five. Ah, and four, burns. come on. And three, two, and one. Very nice. Okay, bring that leg down. Okay, the last one on this side. Repeat the combo on the other one, and you guys are done. So hand right underneath the shoulder. Okay. Don't put it out here. Don't put it in here. We want the body to be aligned. So lift up into an assisted side plank. Okay, elongate the top leg. Hand on the hip. All you're gonna do is lift it up and down. Lift and lower. Up. Nice. So as you can see, we're getting a little bit oblique action here. We got Ooh. some thighs, and we got booty all in one. All in one. Yeah. It's like these small movements just really isolating are so hard. I'm sweating. Oh, you're glistening. You don't need burpees. You just need this. You just need this. Come on. Yeah. Me and burpees, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that bottom butt cheek. Do you feel that? Oh, yeah. It is like stabilizing. My are on fire, Ooh, Cassie. I love Woo. it. <laughs> Well, this is how we celebrate our first meeting. That's right. Right? With right. booty burn? With some booty burn. <laughs> All right, give me five and four. Come on. Three. So good. Two. Last one. One and down. Oh, my oh. goodness. Only oh, quickly on the other side. I thought you'd never say that. <laughs> no time to waste here. Okay? You guys need your bikini butt. You need it fast. Nobody has time, right? So, fetal position. Hand right underneath. And we open and close. Lift and close again, squeezing that butt. Up. And it's already on fire. It is already on fire. Because it was working. <laughs> Anna, do you, um, do you have your bikini picked up for spring and summer yet? I think I'm going to go get a new one just in, in honor of this workout. In honor of this workout. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. yeah, I just went on vacation actually, and um, I bought five new bikinis. What? Well, you know what? With Instagram and everything, I feel like I have to wear a new bikini in every picture. You do. Know, ah! Do you understand? Or do you not understand? I understand. I do not have five bikinis, but I might have to catch up. Uh, well, especially when you have a nice little bun to show off. Booty. Not you already ah! do, but you know what I mean? Like, more popping. Who's dying with me? <laughs> She's having fun. I'm dying. I just, I just talked to you guys. Give me three and two and more. 
one. Okay, elevate, lift up that top leg. We repeat the torture on side two. Let's go. And mini circles. <laughs> awesome. Okay, guys, long leg. Again, do not lean back like this. Okay, everything is forward. Chest is open. Hips are square towards us. Yes, lengthen that leg even higher. Good, come on, squeeze. Long leg, you know what really helps me too is when I squeeze my quads, I feel like my legs, um, they can really straighten. So if you're having yeah. trouble with that, you know, obviously stretch every day, but you can also squeeze your quads and that helps mm -hmm. you straighten your leg. Reverse it. That's so true, that yes. did help me because my flexibility needs improvement. I'm always working on it. <laughs> oh, you know, we are always working on everything, right? That's right. Totally, I feel like, just goal, life uh, life goal. If you can be better than you were yesterday, you're winning, right? You Amen to that. You stronger than you were yesterday. That is all. Don't compare yourself Ooh. to anyone else. And that's why I really love fitness. I feel like I'm competing against myself and I'm not really a sports person and I think that's part of the reason why. Um, and I really just fell in love with this because of, you know, me wanting to get stronger every day for, for me, you know? That's so awesome. Yeah. That's important. Three, two, and one, oh. bring it down. Okay, last one. Hand underneath the shoulder. It's the only reason you I got through that is because good. of your story. <laughs> Hand right underneath. Okay, side plank, hands on the hip. Let's do this. We're up and down, and lift and lower. And guys, once you finish this, you're done with your bikini booty workout. Fast and efficient. Fast and efficient, that's how we do it, okay? Because we don't have time. I know you don't have time, but you also shouldn't have excuses. That's right. Up and I love down. her. <laughs> I love you. I love you guys too. <laughs> Up and down. Wow. I'm like shaking right now. Me too. I am shaking. <laughs> I am sweating. I am burning. Oh Let's do this. This bottom butt is like, can we please ah! stop right now? Up and down. Come on. Lift and lower. Okay. How's that breathing? What do you do? You exhale on the way up. You inhale down. Up and down. Flat five. Five. Come on. Four. Almost there. Three. Come jump count with us. Two. two. And hold it. One. one. Hold it. Hold it just because. And down. Oh, I can oh, hardly oh, hold it. Oh, amazing. Oh my gosh. Let's get started. Okay. So right here, little bend in those knees. Tuck your tailbone, chest up, collarbone wide. We're going to go into a set of 21s. So you're going to go halfway up in that bicep curl and then all the way down. Really think about touching the weights down to your thighs and then only coming up halfway, making that 90 degree angle with your elbow. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna tell you up front, I'm not good with math. <laughs> so, they're 21s, we should be doing seven, half up, but listen, we wanna look good, so oh, maybe yeah. we'll do two more. <laughs> right, here you go, two. Love it. And then we're gonna hold it right here, and then we're gonna go all the way up to the shoulder level, and then halfway down. So squeeze your bicep up, oh, yeah. and then release it. The tension is only halfway, and then you gotta go right back up again. You gotta show off those biceps. Let's go four more right here. Oh, Good. Yeah, take Three. up arms, baby. All the time. Especially us, we live in LA. There's no excuses. That's right. <laughs> and then we're gonna go all the way down, full range. We're gonna hit seven. But again, you have more time. Maybe you have to wear something like a strapless <laughs> dress. I don't know. You get a few more in. Here we go for four. Good. Oh, yeah, feeling the burn. Three. Burst. So I know you probably wanna drop them, but I don't want you to. Two. And then we're gonna take it all the way up on one and then slowly release this last one down for a negative. Perfect, so now we're gonna open nice. it up. W curl, just how it sounds. You're gonna take it out wide, outward curl, squeeze that bicep, all the way down, bring your pinkies together to the center. Exhale Ooh. up. Good, so you're making that W, watch your shoulders, keep them away from your ears. Good, so we're gonna do this for a minute. So in a minute, on your level, maybe you get eight to 12 in, maybe you're more advanced or your weights are lighter. Yeah. Maybe something I more like 12 to 15. Vibes. You can feel it, the thing is, if you're really putting your mind into your muscles, it's gonna work. Oh yeah. Good, you have six more here. And I feel it even in my grip strength, just kind of gripping on right. to those dumbbells. I know, and often if my weights are a little heavier because I'm not afraid of lifting heavy weights, I'll put on some gloves because I still want to have soft hands. <laughs> Good, you have two more here. Ooh. These are perfect. And then one more, and this is the kicker. We're gonna bring it up right in front, get that neck long, you're gonna wrap it out. So wrap it all the way out, Show off that bicep every time. Ooh. Bring it back in. Good, so where are you feeling this? Bicep, okay, shoulders. Good. Perfect answer, Arms. there you go. Still keeping those abs tight for me, wrap it out and in. Good, and then we can pick up that pace again. And you're like, it is burning. Wow. Right? You look good, let's get 10. Nine, eight, seven, 
six, perfect five. Keep that 90 four, degree bend. Three, I know, you don't, don't wanna let drop them drop it. too low. Give me one more. Perfect, now I want you to take those weights right underneath your rib cage here, right okay. underneath your chest. Take a slight lean forward, and then we're gonna kick it out to the side. So we're gonna hit the tricep. Oh yeah. So what you wanna make sure is that you're not flaring those weights up. Squeeze the tricep Squeeze out, out, and then right back up, yes. Good. Oh, love that. So if you're doing this in front of the mirror, you can really try to fight for that tricep to stick out. Good, you look great. I like this one a Perfect. lot. Perfect. Let's go for 10 here. Nice, good breathing, nine. Eight, this is fantastic. Seven. And flex. Right, flex it every time. That tricep is so key. Yeah. Changes the way your whole arm looks. You can really show off in dresses and tank tops. Just feel confident, nothing's gonna flare or fly away when you wave right. at someone, right? That's right. Good, two more. Awesome, and one. And then this is my favorite move. After everything we just did, the biceps and the triceps, think about when you're in a sprint. I mm -hmm. like to bring one foot forward for stability. I like it. Abs tight and sprinting arms. So you really wanna pump your arms. You can start at a slow pace. Squeeze your biceps, squeeze your tricep. Good, you look like you're a professional runner here. Whoa. And then let's get a little faster. So we're gonna go one minute here. So again, you start slow, you pick up the pace. Awesome, you look good. And let's pump right. it out. Good, here we go. 25 Whoa. seconds. Good, awesome. So the shoulders just kind of stabilize and stabilize just really work exactly. in highs and buys. I love it. Yep, and the heart rate gets up a little and what's going on with the core? Everything has to stay tight yeah. or you're gonna fall right over. That's right. Good, here we go, 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, Seven, Burn. six, get it, five. If you're in that full sprint, what do you look like? Four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Ooh. So let's stretch out those arms okay. now that we really added some strength wow. and tone to it. Yeah, we haven't dropped those weights. Put your weights down. The whole time. Five minutes. Take that arm forward. Gently press down on the wrist. Feel the stretch up your forearm. Beautiful. And bicep. Into your bicep. Perfect. Take that same arm. Good. Bring it across. Yes. Opposites attract right here. <laughs> Good. Take the arm back. Pull down on the elbow, Ooh. lean your head back into it. Good, shake it out, other side. Bring that wrist People down. always forget to stretch the upper body. You know, it's, it's like so you stretch important. your hamstrings, you stretch your glutes, but really should. And think about everything, if you're carrying in groceries, if mm -hmm. you're sitting at your car and you're stressed in traffic, this also just really is tension in the neck. Mm -hmm. Good, take that arm back. Awesome, now look, if you have more time, you can run through this circuit all over again. Oh, Five yeah. minutes, takes no time. You get up, you get it done. All right, so let's start down on the floor with a nice up-down plank. We're gonna go down on the elbows and then up on the hands. I love starting with this move because it does work the back, shoulders, and chest. So we're getting a lot of muscles warmed up at the same time. Notice how I'm going down on my left, my right. I'm gonna switch about halfway through here so that I can lead with the other arm as well. You always wanna make sure you create that balance in your strength training. All right, leading with the other side next. Here we go. Let's go up on the other arm first. So take a second to switch. Press through, make sure you're breathing. Abs are pulled in tight. You can start to feel your shoulders really working. Remember, you can always drop down to your knees if you need to modify this one, but make sure you keep your belly strong, okay? Because I don't wanna see your hips dropping like that. You gotta keep your belly really tight. Okay, up, down, go from the knees if you need to modify. Breathe it out. Get yourself warmed up. All the moves here are gonna give you that good posture, strengthening the chest and back, because when you do that, it gives you that natural lift in your chest. Looking good, strong, okay? Whew, all right. So you're warmed up. We're gonna go into a chest fly. You're gonna grab your weights, come onto your back, now for this one, make sure when you're in that position, you're strong in your stomach as well. So you have your back pulled down towards the floor. You can use the legs up to challenge your core a little more. You're gonna open up the chest, squeeze it back together. All right, you can also just let your feet come down to the floor if you wanna take a breather from the core work and just really focus in on the chest and shoulders. Bend the elbows nice and slight so that you keep your elbows safe. Really nice, exhale on the way together. So you're almost letting those hands touch the ground just before it hits it, okay? So you're opening and then closing, good job. Breathe it out, one more, good. Now here we're gonna go into, right into the chest press. So if your elbows just calf, bring it up. 
You can also add a little rotation, so bring it together. So you open, knuckles are gonna be facing open, and then palms face together. All right, so that little rotation is just gonna work the chest a little bit more, shoulders. If you wanna challenge your core, remember, you can bring those knees up into a 90 degree bend, pull your back flat to the floor, really utilize those abdominals. Good, a couple more. Remember, I always exhale during the exertion, part of the move. All right, inhale and exhale. You're doing great. Who's working their abs right now? Are you, are you working your abs? Are you incorporating it? Good. We only got five minutes, we got five moves. And all these moves are really great to work the chest posture. Gonna give you that nice upright lift in the front side of your body, feeling nice and strong. One more, in and then coming on down. Now, roll it on up and we're gonna go into a single arm push up. So here, you're gonna be on your elbow, one side, and your hand on the other. I'm gonna let my body come all the way to the ground. All the way, come up, push and open. Down, open. So I'm locking out my elbow. You know, not hard, but all the way straight, okay? Down, woo, and open. Now my shoulder on the planked arm, the one that's bent on the elbow, is really working in my shoulder and my back. And then the one that's pushing up straight is really getting more of the chest and shoulder. Push up, open, good. All right, let's go to the other side. So I'm on the elbow, open. You can see that that side has to really support my body as I come up. Good, and really gotta push through that heel of the hand, open up the body. Ooh, my upper body is frying right now. How are you guys doing? Doing good, couple more seconds. Breathe. <sighs> Try to let your whole body come up at once. A lot of people are gonna be like, Peeling up, don't do that. All right, lift everything at once oh, and relax. All right, grab your weights again, come up onto your feet, and now we're gonna work the backside a little bit more, even specifically with the row. So here, gonna have your hands out. Remember, have a nice bend in your knees. Have a straight back. Pull your hands back, squeeze your shoulder blades, and then come all the way back down. So knuckles out, and then palms face in. Squeeze, and the thing here is, you really have to squeeze those shoulder blades. You have to really pull it back, squeeze and forward, because that's where you truly get that posture to really pop open and create that nice solid foundation so that your shoulders don't become rolling forward. That's no good, right? So you don't want your shoulders to roll forward. You wanna keep a nice bend, keep your back straight, lengthen, pull it back, release, and set them down. Great job, hopefully you felt every muscle in your upper body working. Repeat that again if you can, or join me next time. We'll see you later.